assemble your Steam Vac, remove all contents from the carton and identify the following components. The carpet cleaner body with two tanks, the handle assembly, handle bolts and nuts, hose and hose bracket, a tool holder with an attachment screw, an upholstery tool, a nozzle cleaning tool, a bottle of deep cleansing detergent, and the owner's manual. This model also includes a powered hand tool. To assemble, insert the upper handle into the slot and press firmly into place. Insert the two bolts into the holes on the front of the cleaner and slide the hose holder onto the bolt ends in the back. Then tighten the nuts onto the bolt ends using a screwdriver. Remove the screw from the tool holder and insert the tabs of the tool holder into the slots near the bottom of the cleaner. Insert the screw and tighten with a screwdriver. Put the solution tube into the storage clip. Attach the converter end of the hose onto the tool holder and snap into place. Now wrap the hose counterclockwise onto the hose storage clips. There are also storage hooks on the back for the power cord. The upholstery tool stores on the bracket on the back of the cleaner. The powered hand tool stores neatly in the front tool compartment. Insert the solution tank by setting the bottom edge in first and pivoting the top of the tank back into the locked position. Your Steam Vac carpet cleaner is now assembled and ready to operate. There is a Contact Us sticker on the back of the cleaner with an 800 number if you would like to talk to a customer service representative. When you call, be sure to have the model number and manufacturing code from the data label on the back of the cleaner. Click on the tabs marked Operation and Maintenance for helpful video demonstrations. And be sure to read through your owner's manual for additional information about your Hoover Steam Vac Carpet Cleaner.